Hello guys, you want to know how I'm getting ready for the London Lambertsal Marathon first race of the year? Check this out. Beautiful medals, going for my fourth London Lambertsal Half Marathon. Looking forward to see the medal. And here we go. First of all, GoPro 11 is Ryan's camera. He lent it to me. I don't have my camera. And Adidas Boston 12. Garmin Solar Instinct, ready to go, full battery. My Adidas Adi Zero, they are gonna be perfect companion for the race. Last time I used the Vaporfly, but this time I go for Adidas. I use it in training, I use it in series, it's been amazing. Sunglasses, of course. Electrolyte tablets, uh, checking 20 wood grams and everything. It's the first time I use this brand, let's see what happened. My favorite gels, torque gel. I have one caffeine and one strawberry yogurt. The caffeine I'm going to leave it for the end. Let's see what happened. And the strawberry yogurt I run after 6-7 kilometers just to see what's going on. Number 895 in case anyone wants to check on me in the application. London Landmarks. My social media. Facebook, Instagram, YouTube. <laughs> my nailer just in case. Effects of COVID attacking. And obviously my Laker short. I mean Kobe Bryant socks. Mamba mentality all the way. And just in case, my knee protector, Adidas, I have like for 10 years, I'm still using it. And here we go. Everything ready. London landmarks. Here I go. Then as you can see, I have my things ready. And sometimes people can think, people don't run like they believe like, ah, it's too much. They're exaggerating. And why they use gels? Why this? I just say one thing. Every runner is different. Every runner have a special like manias, like I said, I'm not sure it's the word in English, but you have your things you like to do. You like to run with your special shorts, you like to run with your special t-shirt, you like to run with, with special socks, etc. So some people don't like to run and record. I love that because I have my channel. And t-shirt, I use one social media, my, my t-shirt special with my, my, my social media. Sometimes I run with the t-shirt of the Charity I represent, sometimes I run with the Morton Wars, sometimes I run with the... I used to run with t-shirts by Iron Maiden. <laughs> that is totally personal. Advice I give for the new runners, because these people running races, especially this weekend, I think it's Manchester Marathon. I knew some people like they're going to do it for the first time. What can I say? Never use something you never try in training. The gels I'm using, I've been trying like for the last three, four months. They are amazing. They work really well with my stomach. Then it's something like I'm not going to risk myself in the middle of the race to try something i never tried before uh, sunglasses i have it i always use it it's comfortable if i don't i put it in my pocket and that's it i'm not gonna run my backpack this time then i'm gonna try to take the minimum possible to avoid carrying extra weight apart from the camera i'm gonna run with the camera in the hand and, and the the mobile phone is gonna be in one of my pockets and the gels on the pocket as well and nothing else. That's it. And not even carrying documents and ID, anything, because all the numbers and identification is on the beep and the number. Then basically it's that. You just need to be ready with your training, ready with your mind, ready with your goal and thinking you have to do this. For example, in my case, my best half marathon was 147.01, London Armax, by the way, in 2022. And this time, if I do 459, not if I do. This time I will do 4.59 a kilometer. That's my goal. Then I'm going to finish in 1.45 something to beat my goal and get my PB. It doesn't happen. It's part of the game. I haven't been training properly the last few days. And I know I'm, I'm not in my best weight. I'm not in my best shape. But my mentality. Let's see what happens. Okay, guys, keep an eye. Video is going to be online Sunday night or maximum Monday morning, but I believe Sunday night is going to be okay because I'm going to record, I'm going to upload the videos, I'm going to edit it quickly, pff, go. Okay, all the best for everyone racing this weekend in any race anywhere. I know it's going to be Valle Nevada in Spain, I'm going to be, I think it's Manchester Marathon this weekend or, or the next one, I'm not sure, but always there's races around. Um, last thing before I forget, 4 of May in Dover is going to be the first backyard ultra inside one prison ever in the history. It's, it's in the world. It's one massive event. It's going to be the first time backyard ultra organized for hellfire events. It's going to be inside the prison, the city, the hidden Dover. It's going to be amazing. The backyard ultra, I'm going to be doing one video again explaining how the backyard ultra works, how this the type of the race, why you run 6.7 kilometers or 4.1 miles. People don't know that. 
and basically explaining every step, what you need to do, how you need to train, how you need to prepare. It's more things involved because about food and, 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 and things like it's not just running because it's not a normal race. It's, it's a total different event. Keep an eye because after the London Landmarks, I'm going to be doing one video explaining that and how I'm preparing for the London Marathon. That's going to happen in 21st of April, in two weeks. And still, I'm going to be posting the link for charity, representing more than World Charity that time. Then keep an eye. Don't miss that. I still need to do the review of the normal Tomir. That's the shoes I'm going to be using. I'm going to be using at the Baggy Ultra in 4 May. Organized for Hellfire events. Link below. Don't miss this opportunity. It's a nice offer for the price. It's a really good opportunity. And even we have one event coming in 7 hours Baggy Ultra. In case you don't want to do massive amount of hours, you do like 7. It's a still it's a still brutal. But it's a can of first step in the world of the ultra running. Okay, guys, keep an eye. Sunday night, video of the London Lamar's Half Marathon 2024 from London. Keep an eye, I'll be there, hopefully with a BB. See you soon, guys.